Hi guys, my name's Abby, and this is my pal RJ. RJ, do you know how deep water has to be for someone to drown in? Six feet? Three feet. What do you think about one foot? Well, you'd actually be wrong. It only takes up to three inches of water for someone to drown in, which is why it's important around your house and in your yard, watch for water, be on guard. Some things we need to watch out for are not only ourselves and our little swim buddies, but also our little brothers and sisters. Sometimes the little ones like to crawl and walk away from the adults and head to objects that they shouldn't, like water-filled objects. What are some objects, RJ? Very good, RJ. Kiddie pools, buckets, and bathtubs are some of the biggest dangers that we could find. Remember, it is not only important to have a swim buddy to keep safe, but also to keep an eye on the little ones. In your house and in your yard, watch for water, be on guard. Hi kids, Steve-O Safety Shark here with another important lesson. In your house, in your yard, watch for water, be on guard. With me is my good friend, Dr. Dory. Say hi, Dr. Dory. Hello. So Dr. Dory, what kind of things do we need to watch out for in our house and in our yards? Large buckets of water, kiddie pools, and even bathtubs. Wow, why do we need to watch out for those things when they're filled with water? Well, did you know that you can drown in only three inches of water? I did not know that, Dr. Dory. I guess that's why it's important that in your house and in your yard, watch for water. Be on guard. Hi kids, Steve-O Safety Shark here with another stroke, the front crawl or the freestyle. The front crawl is just like the back crawl, except you are on your front like the name. We start off in our front float position, eyes down, chest down, then we add our flutter kick, and we reel our arms like giant windmills, reaching and pulling, reaching and pulling, reaching and pulling. Let's have a demonstration and see what that looks like. Wow, that was pretty impressive. Notice how they kept going in a straight line and they kept their legs kicking and their arms moving at all times. As long as you can keep your flutter kick going, your eyes down and your arms out of the water, you can do the front crawl too. Mm -hmm. 